Tips on categorizing videos on watchno.org. Problem 1 on sorted videos. When you start a new video, you don't have to choose a category. But if you don't, your video will show up here in unsorted videos. It's kind of a no man's land. The video will be hard for users to find here. But it's easy to categorize videos that are in unsorted videos. I'll categorize this one. Simply open up the directory to where you want to put the video. And then drop your video into the category. Problem 2. Using too broad of a category. Here is the languages category. But notice, this video is about basic French in particular. It isn't about languages in general. It is about a specific subtopic. In fact, it really belongs here. So let's move it. Problem 3. The category you need doesn't exist yet. This is a video that needs to be moved from the general mammals category to a more specific category, a category about beavers and muskrats, I guess. But there is no beavers and muskrats category here. What should I do? Create a new category like this. Now go back to the mammals category and then drag the video into the beavers and muskrats category. Problem 4. Too many videos in a category. Here's another problem. The U.S. Civics category currently has 32 videos in it. If it has more than 10, then People will have to page ahead to see the other videos in the category. Few people will want to do that. And besides, surely you can find some more specific categories to put these in. That will really help people. So create new categories if you need to. Then move videos there. Lather, rinse, and repeat until all of the videos that were in this general category have been placed into more specific categories, at least if they are about more specific topics. How to deal with multi-part videos. Notice sometimes you'll find a whole bunch of videos all in a series, like this Leonardo da Vinci biography series. In fact, there are two da Vinci biography series here, and it's very confusing. What should you do there? Well, you should make special categories for each series, with the title in quotation marks and the word series in parentheses, like this. Then move all of them into the new category. In the end, the category is much easier to navigate. Problem 5. Duplicate Categories Look here in the History category. There is a category about Winston Churchill here and also here. Oops, what should you do? First, click on both categories to make sure that they are about the same topic. Hmm. Some biographies there. Looks like they're duplicates. So we can simply combine them. Decide which category you want to keep, say this one, then drop the other category into it, like this. And finally, delete the category that you just moved.
the videos that were in the deleted category are now in the remaining category. By the way, perhaps there shouldn't even be a world biography category. Also, to prevent duplicate categories in the first place, please do a little advanced research. Just drill down in some possibly relevant categories and see if the category you want to create is already there. Also, be sure to look at the category descriptions here and follow cross-references that have been added. Add new category descriptions yourself when they'll be helpful. Problem 6. Specialized category not filed deeply enough. One problem with underdeveloped parts of the directory is that you'll find rather specialized categories like podcasting here under very general categories like computers and technology. You would expect podcasting to be a sub-subcategory of internet. So what should you do? Drill down in the internet and see if there's already a podcasting category. Yes, there is. So simply drag podcasting to where it belongs. Then delete it. Don't worry too much if you don't have it absolutely perfect. Editing the directory is easy and others will eventually help. Just do what you can. Problem 7. Category names not in title case. We use title case for our category titles. Here's a category name that is written in lower case. Just right click it and choose rename and change it to title case. 